Now we'll try to understand different words related to marriage. After that, it is a nubile. Nubile means marriageable, especially of the girls. If any girls are matured or she has crossed 18 years, she is looking good, everything is there, then we can say it is a nubile, it is marriageable. Next word is nuptial. Nuptial is related to marriage. Related to marriage, anything if you are discussing or anything is there, any issue, then we can say it is a nuptial issue. Another word is there connubial related to married state. Conjugal means once marriage happened, you are in married condition, then it is a connubial issue or connubial condition. Prenuptial before marriage. Pre means before, nuptial means related to marriage, means before marriage, what is hap happening? It is prenuptial. Based on that, you can say pregnancy that is also related to same words. Now, marriage. You can say just equivalent words, you will find plenty of words, not in uh, you can say one country, if you will just go to the different different country, then variety of words are there, like uh, one word is there, alliance, civil marriage, consortium, hymen, matrimony, misalliance, mismatch, monogamy, monogamy, union, wedding, I think no need to explain, all these words we know and we have crossed already during our reading practice or something but just i am refreshing wedlock polygyny polygyny polyandry just why i highlight gyny means women andry means andry means andros andros means andrology means it is man it is women who are having many women that is polygyny who are having many men uh, still in india also like you can take the just example of Mahabharata also. One Draupadi was having the five men. Polyandry. Polyandric system. Polyandria. Remarriage. Trigamy. Bigamy. Illegal second marriage if you are doing that is bigamy. Extramarital. Extramarital means other than marriage if you have any relation with any of the person. Extramarital relation. After then uh, marriage after death or divorce of first two. Due to gamy. That is uh, marriage after death or divorce of the first spouse. After then, another word is there, unite, union, splice, all are same meaning. Now we will come to the different type of marriage. If you will just look our ancient scripture, I am not, I am not discussing here because it will take much time. Then we are having the 10 type of marriage, 10 type of marriage system. If you will see from that point of time practice, then that point of time, if any strong people are there, any king is there, if any woman he like, then he can just capture and afterwards they can do the marriage. Maybe forcibly also marriage can be happened. That was also one of the system under marriage. Due to once Ravan has taken Sita, then Rama has started to attack Lanka and everything was doing to just uh, take back the Sita. Then Ravan was sometimes surprised why he is doing like that. This is our culture. This is our culture. In demon culture, in demon culture, it is very common type of marriage. You captured some girl and done the marriage. Uh, still many of the country they are following. Due to that time, multi-marriage was there. That demon, who will be demon, they will have, mult, they will have multiple women. But that time Ram has shown one of the dharma, no, one person, one marriage only. And due to we are telling Mariyada Purushottam Bhagavan Sri Ram. 